Hi, this is Kelly McKenzie again. This episode, it's another cancer one, but this time it's about losing your hair and how stressful and upsetting that can be. And the best way to cope with it, especially as women, is that wearing wigs, even having fun with different wigs. I have another wig that's like a reddish color. I might wear that sometime. This one's a newer one. And I'm ordering another one too. That will have longer hair like I used to. Just trying out different colors is the best way to cope with losing your hair. And just telling yourself that you will get your hair back. I mean, I've heard of rare cases that your hair could grow back curly if you had straight hair or vice versa or a completely different color. But most people I've known that didn't happen. And look on the bright side. You're saving your life getting chemo. I mean, I know that losing your hair is a fish, it's a superficial thing, but it's human to feel that way. Guys, in my opinion, they don't have it as bad. I could be wrong, but usually a guy, he just puts on a hat. You know, baldness look better on men than women. So the best thing to do as a woman is wear wigs. Get creative. Try different wigs. Get a whole bunch of wigs. One day you wear blue hair. Next day you wear green. Then you want to be a blonde. Then you want to be a brunette. Or a redhead. Or black hair. Whatever you want to do. That's my suggestion. Get a bunch of wigs. I mean, sometimes if... Like around Halloween, that's a good time. Get a bunch of wigs that you would see on Halloween. They have like funky color hair, like a rainbow unicorn, unicorn color. That, that's kind of cool. Just trying things out until you get your hair back. So, just hang in there. If you're a person like me that lost their hair, just hang in there. Think positive. This is only temporarily. And thanks for watching, and please subscribe.